Hello friends, welcome to Math IT classes. Now we have a simple question where examiners will often like to trick you. So the question appears simple and it is simple. But there is a trap on that. The question is this. There is a particle moving along a straight line with an initial velocity u equal to 50 meter per second. And the acceleration of minus 10 meter per second squared. Right, this should be second squared. We have to find the distance traveled in the first six seconds. Remember, the trap is that you cannot directly apply s equal to u t plus half a t squared in one go. Do you know why? Because s in that equation is displacement, and here after five seconds, velocity becomes zero. So the particle goes like this and then comes like this. You understand? So if you directly use s equal to u t plus half a t squared, you will get this displacement. Instead, you want the total distance traveled in this uh, path. Correct? So for that, you have to split the motion into two parts. One, from t equal to 0 to t equal to 5 and from t equal to 5 to t equal to 6. So here you have to do S1 is equal to u which is 50 into 5 plus half into minus 10 into t square t which is 5 which is 25 which is equal to 125 meters and for the second step from t equal to 6 t equal to 5 to t equal to 6 you have to do s2 equal to 0 into 1 because initial velocity now is 0 plus half into minus 10 into 1 square which is going to give you minus 5 but the problem is this shows displacement and the displacement while it is minus 5, the distance traveled is the mod of that which is equal to plus 5, right? So, the total distance traveled by the body is 130 meters. If you directly use s equal to t plus half t square, you are going to get the answer as 120 meters, which is wrong. Alright, so if you have any doubts or if you want any questions answered, you can comment down below. There will be upcoming classes. See you guys tomorrow.